Okay, so um, I just finished meditating. I noticed that this meditation and my morning meditation both, I was very, um, kind of felt wiry. My mind has just been going, going, going on like full speed ahead. Um, so I don't know if it's because I'm traveling. Um, but, uh, there's a, there's some stuff stirring up right now. And don't get, don't get me wrong, I love traveling. Like, I live to travel. I just always want to be on the road or just going new places. And um, But I think part of what's happening is that it's reminding me that um, I don't have a partner. And um, I know that's so stupid, but especially because I've been saying, like, I don't, I don't want a relationship. And I, and I don't necessarily. I think it's just a reminder that I've lost something. And that, um, I, one of my fears is, um, you know, being forgotten or, um, alone forever or something. I don't know. So that's been kind of stirring up. So I'm just noticing that, that like, huh, why is this kind of coming up right now? And I'm just, you know, getting ready to leave and do something really cool. I'm going to Nashville for a um a music opportunity and i'm gonna stay with a friend and i'm really 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 excited about it um i just thought it was interesting how that how this other kind of emotion and um stuff started to kind of stir up a little bit um the other thing i'm noticing like which is just so it's it's like a really i know it's gonna sound stupid but um I'm struggling with body image right now a lot. Um, I know that's so superficial and it's weird. Cause like I have these moments where I'm just, I'm totally fine. I'm very like, I'm like, okay, I'm just having this experience and you just, you're just noticing it. It it's, it's not, it's, it's just, it's not you. It's just your human experience or whatever. But I um have been really struggling lately. Um, I feel like part of it. I mean, I understand like psychologically why um, I have had this issue in my in my past. Like due to abuse, you know, you tend to want to control something, right? So you control your your body weight. Typically, is what a lot of survivors do. Um, and so I know that's, that's been a part of it, but it's, but now, and it's partly maybe because I just recently saw a bunch of pictures of myself as, as a teenager and looking at them was really sad because all I saw was eating disorders. Every picture I was like, oh, yep, that's when I wasn't, that's when I wasn't eating. And oh, yep, I was um binging and purging there. My cheeks were so puffy and it's just so sad. <laughs> so I like looked at all these pictures and I could tell every picture where I was within my spectrum of an eating disorder and um that became just very daunting to me um in some ways uh but then to also like go god damn why is this still uh something that's there you know like granted like um I know I having gone through a really difficult time last year I lost a significant amount of significant amount of weight I was underweight and I needed to gain weight and I I I understand that and I yes that was the healthy thing to do but now I'm in this space where I'm like oh I think I gained too much weight and I'm like kind of freaking out and it's like but why like what is what is it what is it about that why is that so why is why does my brain still do that even without having with not having any kind of like um survival like i don't i don't know it's just it's just interesting um and for the most part i have more a, a ton um like my days i my <laughs> wow how do i say this i feel better and better in terms of that mindset um as I progress but I think what 
what gets to me is just going, why is this, why today, why, why is today so significant in feeling, you know, extra about this, you know, and, um, what, what, what did something like, I'm trying to just be aware and, and mindful of like, what, what got me here? Why did this, why am I thinking so much, you know, that way? And like, or why is my, why, why do my clothes fit tighter right now? Like what happened? <laughs> you know, like, it's just, it's that and it and it's and it's hard because it's like well, I hate getting so caught up in it of like oh I was like swimming in this this outfit like you know 6 months ago and now I'm like now it's tight on me and I hate like obsessing over that I don't like to be in that mindset and like then to figure out like what's the next step how do I um how do I fix this and then your your mind at least my mind goes immediately to like oh you can't eat for like a week you know and that never does anything because like what I understand is that when you're not eating, um, your body goes into like flight or fight mode. And then once you start eating again, it like start, so it goes into flight or fight mode and you basically like it's, it's in shock. So you lose this weight and then the second you start eating, it stores it because it's like scared that it's going to go into that like um, uh, starvation mode again. So so it's like I understand all of this stuff this is not like news to me I understand how all of this works I've done it for my entire life but what's interesting to me is that like I feel these are all things I notice now or I kind of see it from a different angle but I guess what's what's difficult in this moment is like why is this still feel why 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 is this thing still getting me why is it still getting me to that point why do i why does it bum me out so much um i don't know those are just i'm i'm just kind of sitting with that right now and um trying to allow it to just be and not push it away and being honest about how i'm feeling and not feel guilty about about that but honest and 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 I'm not getting like the good thing is I can, again because I'm in a different perspective on it of it of everything I'm not like being destructive anymore which is good but I just want to I guess I just have to let it go through I just have to allow it to be and go and just pass um I think another thing too is I, I was working out and then I stopped when I had my fall because I needed to heal and rest and I think that that was something that probably affected me but it's just interesting how these uh these things this like so it's so stupid like who cares but I don't know <laughs> It's uh, it's still something that I, that I notice that is a factor in my life, and um, I wish that it wasn't. So there you have it. There's some, there's some honesty for you. Um, if you deal with that, I would love to speak with you about it further. Uh, maybe it can be helpful. I don't know. Um, but I'm going to be vlogging my, my traveling process a lot, a lot tomorrow and, um, it should be a good time. So I will talk to you soon. Mwah.